staff and the families at Falling Creek, I want to welcome you to our community. Now whether this is your first time or you've been coming here for years, it's going to be an amazing summer. But before you have that memorable time, one important thing has to happen, you have to get here. So let's start with the basics. If you're going to have that amazing time at camp this summer, it's not a bad idea to know our location. Now, I've been coming here since I was eight years old, so I know it by heart. But you're going to want to know that GPS address. Yates, how you doing? Jim boy, I'm doing great. How are you? I'm, I'm just telling everybody how to get here. That's what I thought you were doing. But you're not at Fallen Creek. I'm not at Fallen Creek. You're at Greystone. I'm at Greystone. To avoid embarrassing situations like this, set your GPS to 2900 Green River Road, Zirconia, North Carolina, 28790. We're three miles from Roscoe's, 45 minutes from Asheville, two hours from Charlotte, 30 minutes from Greenville, four hours from Chattanooga, six hours from DC, nine hours from New Orleans, 11 hours from New York, three days from Los Angeles, four days from Honolulu, three days from London, and four days from Sydney. Jeffries, the program director here at Folly Creek Camp. No matter the time zone, we're excited to greet you between 9.30 and 11.30 on the Sunday your session starts. Parking at camp is limited, so if you have a friend or family member that wants to come along, we suggest you carpool. The drive into camp is a beautiful mountain road, and like all beautiful mountain roads, it's best enjoyed when driving slow. So this might be a good chance to leave the Porsche in the garage and bust out the Mini. Part of the Oklahoma land rush, here we have what's been known as the Fallen Creek Camper Rush, which happens when everyone arrives at 9.30 on the nose. If you get here too early, you may encounter one of those traffic pilots you left behind in the city. So take your time getting to camp on opening day. Getting on and off the mountain seems to work best later in the morning. When you pack your car before coming to camp, make sure you pack it so we can get to your trunk easily. And don't worry about having to lug your trunk across camp. Our staff takes care of everything. If your son's trunk has wheels on it, please take them off before you put them in your vehicle. We want your Fallen Creek experience to start as soon as you get here. So after you park, head on to the dining hall for a map and some directions. Then you can head straight up to your cabin and meet your counselors and your cabin mates. Your beds will already be made for you, and your trunk will be brought up by another staff member. Oh! Our staff takes care of getting your trunk to your cabin, and once you settle in, we have games on the field to help you get to know your soon-to-be camp buddies and counselors. You'll find out that at Falling Creek, we're all about good, clean fun. Safety is a major concern here at Fallen Creek, but so is making sure that your son stays healthy. If he takes any daily medications, be sure to stop by the infirmary on opening day and go over the medications with our nursing staff. Common medications such as pain relievers, antihistamines, ear drops, wound ointments, and antacids are not allowed in the cabins, but don't worry, we have plenty stocked in our infirmary, so you don't need to bring them. If your son needs an inhaler, bring two. Just in case he can't find his, we'll always have one in the infirmary. We're all about safety here at Fallen Creek, especially when it comes to activities on the water, which we do a lot. So one important opening day activity is our swim check, which we ask each camper to take to assess their swimming skills. Campers are asked to swim four 25 meter lengths of freestyle, one length of elementary backstroke, and then to tread water for five minutes. We ask campers who need to work on their skills to take swim lessons until we feel they are at a level safe enough to take out of camp trips, like river trips and sailing. During free time, campers wear PFDs for free swim and while paddling on the lakes, so everyone can participate in these activities, regardless of their swimming ability. 
Strong swimmers are welcome to sign up for swimming to improve their endurance, work on progressions, and just have fun. A common question that parents ask on opening day is, how long should we stay? We know as parents it can be tough to leave your son. On opening day, we recommend letting the camp experience begin as soon as possible. Not that we're being inhospitable, but letting your camper get to know their new friends and get involved in activities are important for a successful opening day. Opening day is really important to us because it's the first chance to welcome new campers in and old campers back to the Falling Creek Camp community. We want your opening day to be an amazing experience. So if you have any questions, give us a call and I'll see you here Falling Creek Camp.